Hey, it's the footy coach here. Looks like Liverpool have started to make moves to prepare for the departure of Jurgen Klopp and his backroom staff. As a club, they'll be looking, of course, at first to fill their empty position of sporting director dash director of football. So, who's been the name linked? Well, it's Tim Stighton, who is the current director of football at West Ham. A man who also has links to Xabi Alonso. We'll come to that later. I know a couple of West Ham fans have been really impressed with his signings, albeit not impressed with how David Moyes has been using them. So, how's this come about? Well, Tim Stighton, like Jurgen Klopp and Liverpool's outgoing sporting director, Jorge Schmatka, is another German who pretty much says what he thinks. He spoke to Florian Petterberg from Sky Germany and said this. I've heard that I'm supposed to be on the list of Liverpool. It is one of the biggest clubs in the world so it's an honor but so far nobody from LFC has contacted me yet I generally feel very comfortable at West Ham I quickly realized how intense this league is accordingly we signed the right players in the last transfer window the squad is strong so we can achieve our goals I'm looking forward to facing the next few weeks and months until the end of the season of course we are already playing the next window what happens to the future we will see now for Liverpool fans here is Steinton's record at West Ham most of the money of course coming from the sale of Decker and Rice you've got Mohamed Kudus who's been outstanding James Ward Prowse as well, Edson Alvarez and Mavropanos coming in for around 122 million in total. Moy should have really done better with these signings, I'd say. Mark Noble recently commented on how Steinton was instrumental in making sure West Ham got Kudus. So that's quite promising. On the flip side, there's been discontent between the manager and Steinton at West Ham with squabbling over transfer targets. I personally believe there needs to be a hierarchy and the director of football should be the man who decides these things. So at Liverpool, that's what's always happened. Now for the Xabi Alonso segment. Steinton was the one who hired Alonso at Leverkusen. Steinton is like another Michael Edwards who believes in a data-driven approach to complement traditional scouting. Considering local setup and prominence on data research with regards to players, this is promising. Some of the stars of the current Leverkusen side were brought in by Steinton, notably the magnificent Wurtz, Edmund Tapsoba, Lacios, Fringpong, Kosanu, Hinkapi and Patrick Schick. Those players have been instrumental in Alonso's unbeaten season so far, going further a field. He also signed Villas Diaby for Leverkusen. Now we can go even further back to his previous role as director of football at Word Bremen where he signed Kevin De Bruyne, Serge Gnabry and Thomas Delaney. The latter two having their careers kick-started after setbacks. We all know how good those guys have been. There's not much more to say on that. Is he a good hire for Liverpool? West Ham fans don't want to let him go but Liverpool would probably be hard to knock back and of course there's the Alonso element. Would hiring Steinton bring Alonso as a manager to Liverpool? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. As always, please do like and subscribe and thank you for watching.